Two Rhode Islanders meet for what one of them calls a one in a million miracle. And it starts with a bizarre discovery in a basement. Eyewitness News reporter Walt Buteau with more in this week's Street Story. This is what happens when something you thought was lost forever is found by someone who cares. Harry and Carol went from never met to forever connected. It was amazing. It blew my mind, honestly. It, it really did. Harry has no idea why the box marked with Norma McMillan's name was mired in the clutter of the basement of his westerly apartment. Carol knows only that a tragic mistake during a move misplaced the box in a storage unit that sold to the highest bidder. But that was five years ago. I just thought she was lost forever. I felt like it just wasn't right that it was down there. Maybe they own. That night in Richmond, Carol had a vision involving her mother that she still can't explain. It wasn't actually a dream. She was just standing there, clear as day, clear as day. Harry had just dusted off the box, made a video, and put it out there on Facebook. And I asked people to please share so that we could find the family of Norma. Instantly. I messaged Harry. I, I was like, I don't believe this. Unbelievable. And it was Carol, and she was ecstatic. That's a miracle. The whole story is a miracle. A miracle, perhaps, for her, and a step towards salvation for Harry, who, about the time she lost the box, was battling a potential life or death choice of his own. Come October this year, I'll be four years clean from opiates and heroin. She's home. She was shaking when I handed her the box, and she gave me a really good minute-long hug, and it just made me feel right. Having her back and sitting there in my living room now, she's home. My mother's home. I have a lot of making up to do, so every day I try to. And he seems to think he has to make up for things he's done in the past. Well, past is past. This is now, and that's all that matters. And she says whether Harry likes it or not, he is now part of her family for bringing her mom home. Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.